Hey, what's going on, guys? How's everybody doing today? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking the body beat down here on this Monday afternoon. Today is chest and leg day. We're keeping it short, simple, to the point, guys. Now, I've already done some warm up sets with the bar and with 95 pounds and 135 pounds. Uh, I just didn't show those, but uh, they were done, and uh, you'll see on my workout log uh, at the end of the video that uh, what all I did. So we're starting off here in the video with 225. We're keeping the reps low and uh, we're just trying to get done today. We're trying to just kind of keep moving forward and keep doing these things. Uh, there's a lot going on here with our move and everything and the mind, you know, is just kind of wandering all over the place. So, uh, you know, just trying to keep things nice and simple and uh, quick and to the point, to the point, no faking. Cooking them seems like a pound of bacon. Uh, wait, uh, that's something different. Anyway. Uh, yeah, so uh, we're going up to 315 here Nothing new guys you've seen all this stuff before but the fact of the matter is is, is this these videos help to hold us accountable uh, They kind of help us as as well whenever we're actually working out and we know we're shooting a video It just kind of helps a little bit, you know uh, It kind of gives you a little extra drive or maybe a little bit more reason almost if you will so the videos help us along with hopefully helping viewers. So we got 315 there, nothing special. And uh, we go on up to 335. And uh, like I've been saying, uh, during all this mess that we're going through right now, as long as I can stay in the threes, I'm happy. And why is my belly popping out like that? What the heck? My good lord. Showing that sexy ab. Uh, now I'm going to have everybody hint me up in the comments about my beautiful ab. Uh, yeah, such is life. Anyway, 335 here. We're just going to get us one little simple rep probably. Uh, I'm not looking to strain too much. And, uh, not bad, not bad considering all things. And uh, we're going up to 355. I want to make sure I can stay somewhere around this area. Uh, because my journey to 405, uh, 405 or 400 pound whatever bench, you know, I want to stay within the realm of possibility. And uh, not that my arm, my shoulder is going to agree, but hopefully at some point in 2024, I might be able to reach my goal. I'm trying to stay hopeful. Uh, and my little foot slipped right there like a big old dummy, like I've never done that before. I've never bench pressed before. That's a brand new move. Yeah, that's it. So anyway, we're going over the squats, and you're going to notice something a wee bit different here, guys. I got my bench up there, and these are called bench squats. Now, this bench is 21 inches tall, which is an extremely tall bench. That's from the floor to the top of the pad. That's a very tall bench. Uh, technically, it, it's way too tall. But it's made for, like, leg attach attachments and stuff like that, so... You know, and it's an older bench, and older benches, they were all a lot taller. Nowadays, they're making them a lot uh, closer to the floor, more uh, regulation height. So anyway, we're doing some uh, bench squats here, and uh, we're just starting out with 135. That's what I started at. I didn't start with the bar, 95, or nothing like that. I just went in through 135 on there, because that's technically not a lot of weight, so... Um, bench squats are good for a couple of things. It's training in general, you know, training your body and your core strength and all that good stuff. But uh, it's also good if your back is not feeling at its best, which mine hasn't been for the last couple of days. Uh, nothing normal, uh, uh, nothing uh, unnormal for me. But uh, yeah, it's been a little bit iffy this past couple of days. So I thought, well, I'll take it easy and do some bench squats. Uh, they're also good just for. Uh, if you have a bad back in general all the time, uh, instead of trying to carry all that weight down further, you know, you got you a good stopping point. So they, they serve a few purposes. Uh, the whole stop and go, it's kind of like a pin press almost, uh, kind of, sort of, uh, when you're bench pressing. And uh, that's a different kind of training as well. So anyway, got some 135. Now we're going to 225, and uh, 
We're not going to do anything too crazy with the reps, I don't think. Uh, I don't remember. I don't think I, I don't think I do too many reps, but we just kind of keep it. Again, just kind of keeping it simple and uh, getting our job done here. So 225. Um, it's good if you if you can uh, do the descent slowly. Sometimes I forget to uh, descend slowly, um, but if you can do that, uh, it, it, it kind of stresses your muscles a little bit more, makes you balance a little bit longer in your core and all and your legs and all that good stuff. So, you know, if you can kind of take the descent pretty slow, that's that's going to help you out. And uh, you can either explode up or you can uh, kind of take your time up as well. All right. So sorry for that slight delay there. If you heard something, my wife was talking to me for a minute uh, about some papers for the house and all that. So anyway, uh, now we're going up to 315. And uh, 315 is a good weight. 315 is good if you can get to that with all your main lifts and even some other lifts. Uh, 315 is just a good weight. 225 is a good working out weight to get to, but then 315 is a good weight to get to and work out and build some serious muscle. So 315 is a good weight. A lot of people will never get to that. So feel, uh, feel good about yourself if you do get to that weight. Well, feel good about yourself if you get to any weight, technically. So, as you notice, I'm trying to go a little bit slower. So, yeah. A uh, pretty decent little workout today. Again, keeping it short and simple to the point. And uh, we go on up. Crazily enough, we go on up to 405. And I'm going to tell you, it felt pretty heavy today. So, but then again, I'm not exactly mentally and physically in the game like I have been. So, 405 was definitely feeling a little bit heavier than it has in the past. Uh, not that 405 is ever light, but some days it don't feel quite so bad. So we're just going to do a couple of sets of one. That's right, I gave you a little glimpse into the future. We're going to do two sets of these with just one rep. So nice little down and up, and here we go. Well, guys, if I give you a little inspiration throughout your day, I've done my job. Uh, you inspire me as well whenever you watch and you leave good comments and all that. That's what this community should be about is leaving good comments and supporting one another no matter what. And I appreciate you and uh, really I do. So uh, anyway, let's go ahead and get this rep here and be done, guys. So I hope you have a good day, good week, good month. Be uh, healthy inside and out, and be happy, too. Make yourself happy, all right? And uh, we're going to try to do the same here. So, everybody, like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff to the Body Beatdown. And don't forget. Yeah. Get out, get rad. Do it to it. Get up, get out, get around and do it, do it!